Hello everybody, this is Charles and here's part 6 of my giant review. Here's Wheel Loader aka Scrapper. I'm just gonna call him Scrapper for easy sake. So Scrapper, uh, Wheel Loader, uh, is a 6 vehicle for giant. Uh, in terms of vehicle mode, you can do this for a shovel, but this part doesn't move, which um, was a little bit of a disappointment. It would be more fun if you know you can move it. Uh, but um, I will be. Oh, let me see. I forgot to put this back. This is actually was part of the vehicle. Makes it look complete and covers up the whole. Yeah. So, okay. I'm just going to transform into robot mode. This has one of the most interesting transformations I've ever uh, experienced. It's really fun. Trust me, it's really fun. First thing what you're gonna do is flip it up here. You're gonna flip the head down. This uh, head is really stiff. Um, I'm gonna use the cloth to dig it out a little bit because of my sweaty palms. Ah. Okay, dig, 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 dig. Yes, and I got it. It's really, really hard. The joint here is really, really hard. Okay, and what I'm gonna do right now, next you're gonna flip uh, this 180 degrees forward. No, boy, 180 degrees backwards or is it forward? It doesn't matter. Yeah, 180 degrees backwards over here. Okay, and once you've done that, you're gonna untap this side, untap this. You're gonna pull the arms down. So this is all the arms. Look at this, this is interesting part. You flip the wheels over, alright, flip out the first, turn it around and you form one arm. Similarly for the other side, you flip this um, downwards first, alright, release the catch, you flip the wheel over, alright, turn the arm around, you release the first. It's really cool, you know, I, I like the transformation of this part. It's really, really cool. The arms part, really, really nice. So here, see this part, and what you're gonna do, you're gonna lift this part up, all right? You're gonna angle it, oh, so, before they're gonna push this to the back, and then this chest component, push in, snap it in place. Okay, and here you have it. Um, Notice that the scrapper's head is a little hidden, uh, but that's just the nature of this 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 figure. It just looks very hidden. And uh, yes, I know this is a little obscene, but let's move on. So what I'm gonna do over here? I'm gonna untap this. Okay, untap this. I'm gonna flip open this. Flip open this. Do note that the legs transformation is another, another interesting part. I'm going to untap this from here, untap this from here, and uh, flipping to the other side. Over here, we're gonna just flip this whole thing out, alright, to the other side. This whole leg compartment part, just gonna flip it out. Okay. Flip it down. Okay, this is one leg, all right? Over here, similarly, I'm gonna flip it down. Here's the other leg. So we have this long, elongated looking part. Close this tab, close this tab. Over here, close this to form the feet. Similarly, close form the feet. Rotate this, push this all the way in. Okay, make sure it locks in place inside. Similarly over here, rotate, push it all the way in, make sure it locks inside, and voila, you have the feet. It's really cool, and oh, almost forgot, you got to uh, rotate the body. Okay, rotate the body, push this to the back. Here, this uh, whole bulky mass, push it this way, and we are done. Okay, and what you can do, you can actually open this part, okay, and store this part. Um, uh, okay, instructions, how do I store it? I think it is stored with the screw facing backwards. Okay, let me try this. Okay, seems to look okay. So this is, um, Scrapper. 
Okay, wheel loader. Um, I'm not sure if I got the transformation slightly wrong. Maybe I have. Okay, maybe this is how he should look. Okay, now we see uh, we see the face of a uh, scrapper wheel loader more clearly now. No, this is a very very nice piece now. I mean, in terms of the transformation, it's really unique. It has its own unique um, transformation. It's really unexpected how you can actually get him from vehicle mode to robot mode. It's just it's also awesome the way the arms and the legs um, form up. It's really really cool. So here's uh, his gun. I'll put here over here. It's just really really cool. And now I'm just gonna put all six constructicons, aka giant, together. I'm just gonna call them constructicons because that's who they really are, model after anyway. Okay, put them all together. Have an impressive group shot. Ah, then you go. No, I'm gonna put you here and put you here. Yes. So here we have a very impressive uh, group shot of the individual giant uh, robots of giant aka constructcons we really, really love them nice quality plastics very tight joints sometimes a little bit too tight but um, better tight than not tight very nice articulation very nice detail uh, and, and feel of the plastics everything's really good uh, highly recommended highly recommended do do get this um, compared to Hercules um, both of them are good in their own ways, but I, my personal preference goes to um, make toys. Um, even though some of the robot modes may not look as nice as the ones for TFC, but quality feel, overall feel is top notch. It is available right now at uh, iShop2Go.com. Do check it out and uh, get your um, giant from them. You can even get Hercules from them if you want to, and if you prefer, you can get both. Anyway, the next part, which is the last part of my video, I'll go through the combination mode of um, Giant. So stay tuned to the last part of my video of Make Toys Giant.